Evening, friends and foes. Friends and followers. Friends and followers. Hello. So we're off of work. It's Friday night. Woo it's exciting stuff. I want to get my hair cleaned up. Your oh. beard trim. And yeah, it was rather difficult to find a place that would actually do it because COVID. COVID has made it difficult. It's ruining everything. There was a nice barber shop I wanted to go to and check out, but they are very much not about doing anything. Yeah. Which I, I understand, but... It's still frustrating. Yeah. You know. Anyways, I'm going to get my hair cleaned up, get my face cleaned up. We might go to dinner. I know we've been eating out a lot more than usual. You might have to... We don't usually do that, by the way. Yeah. I'm usually cooking or Matt's cooking, but... We're still trying to get the workflow and the life flow like set, figured working out. working out. I really need to meal prep, but I haven't had time because uh, my classes start on Monday and today is Friday, but I have to set up my classes tonight, and I'm waking up at like 5.30. I have enough time to get breakfast and prep Matt, Matt a lunch. She's so nice. But um, when I come home, I pick Matt up from work. We are hunting for a place to live, so that's kind of cutting into our evenings, which pushes like, I don't have time to make dinner like, by the time we get home, we're tired, we don't want to cook, and it's so late that it's almost not even worth eating at that point. But I'm starving, so we end up going out, which we don't typically do. Hopefully, that'll like change as soon as I figure out like a routine of how early I need to wake up, how I, I also need to be writing a better menu so I know what I'm making that night. Maybe. We also need to get some stuff from the store. We're kind of overdue in going to the store. We, yeah, we've needed, and, like, we're, and we're kind of like waiting on paychecks still, so. We're still we're, we're still kind of settling into Colorado, even though we've been here a month. It feels like we've been here longer than we have been. Yeah, but it's only been a month. It's probably because we've done so much stuff. We are probably going to be pushing our vlogs instead of daily vlogging to weekend vlogging, unless something like spectacular happens or... Um, we have time to vlog because editing is going to be cutting into my school time and I have to prioritize my classes over the vlog, unfortunately. But I think that you'll get better content if we can do it over a week. I'm not sure how the narrative will look, how the flow of the videos will look going from daily to weekly, but... Be patient with me. I will try to make it um, cool, but I might screw it up too. Or we just might do like the weekend and kind of recap our week. Weekends are more exciting anyways most of the time. So, um, we'll still keep you posted. We are planning to move. It'll, from the looks and sounds of it, it'll probably be by the end of the month or sooner because our moving truck is supposed to be here on Thursday. Yeah, that's not fun. And I'm going to miss my turn, but that's okay. But on that note, we'll, we'll, let, you know, we'll let you guys know how bad my face and hair look by the end of the night. It'll look great. Hopefully. But we'll catch you guys in a few minutes. Look at that pizza. Yeah. Hey y'all, happy Saturday. Happy weekend. I just wanted to come on and talk to you guys real quick about the weekend and about what we have going on today. Um, so as for today, I decided to stay home. Talia is working her first Saturday shift. And um, I just wanted to get some school stuff done get some work stuff done and just kind of relax and watch on YouTube. Um, I got a call today at around 11, uh, yeah, 11, around 11 a.m. today, and Talia said, oh yeah, by the way, I'm sort of working until 3, I'm working until 7, so she's coming off of a 12-hour shift now. So I'm about to go cook dinner and um, just have a lovely night just kind of studying and letting her do some of her class stuff, so. <laughs> Hey guys. Hello. 
I'm home for my first 12-hour shift. How's that? My feet are a little blistery. Otherwise, it was good. Good. I didn't bring food with me to work. So how was your hamburger? It was delicious. Thank you for cooking. Mm-hmm. I'm tired. I'm ready for bed. And I don't have to go back to work until Wednesday. That's nice. I have Sunday, Monday, Tuesday off. So class, 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 class. Class, 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 class. Classes start um, Monday, but I'm already read one chapter tonight. I'm reading another chapter tomorrow. By Monday, I'll have three chapters down. How do you feel about your 12-hour shift? I could do it. Yeah? Yeah. But it could just be, one, I'm limited to what I can do, and two, the hole I'm in. That probably just makes it not fun. To be there for 12 hours when you can only do, like, five things. Yeah. It'll be funner when I'm allowed to do more. I can imagine. But, I think we're going to cut it off here. Yep. You guys probably won't get another vlog until next weekend. Unless something... Right, Super but, happens. Unless we get to do something exciting like Costco or something tomorrow. Or move. Or move, yeah. <laughs> we'll make a decision tomorrow. Um, I think we've already made a decision. But we will finalize our plans tomorrow, and um, we'll keep you guys posted. Yep, it's going to be an expensive slash exciting week coming up. So hopefully, keep us in your prayers, your thoughts, your channels. Just, we're doing all the things we can do, and we'll keep you guys in the loop and up to date as much as we can about everything. And we'll put out a full story as to what happened um, in a future video. So we'll see you guys on the next one. Good night. Good night.